Hey, 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 welcome back, episode 19. 19 indeed, yes. Uh, brought on the deck by the craft beer pioneers. We're becoming stalwarts at this. Exactly. Yeah. And we're at your service. Indeed. Oh, we've got a new beer tonight. And we're excited, as I'm always. Tr truly. Uh, Colonial Draft, uh, so Colonial Brewing Brewing Co, and it's a draft. It's a, no, no draft? draft. Kolsch? Kolsch? Ale? It's, uh, I don't know how to look. It looks German. I'll, I'll, I'll learn some more about it. Let's even see it. Uh, there we go. Spelled K O L S C H. Um, yeah. I think it's probably pretty obvious that we didn't buy this because of the uh, can. No, it's, it's not a lot to it, really, you, folks. It's kind of. Wouldn't have caught my eye in particular. No. No. They have a range. Yeah. They have, they have a draft, and then they, I think they have um, a lager and an Indian IPA and something else. Yeah, right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, All white cans, different coloured print on the cans. And what made you choose it on this one? Well, I don't know, I'm a bit random when I choose. I, I just go for anything that um, <laughs> anything that I haven't had before. Yeah, right. That's my rule. Yeah, good. Yeah. 4.8%. Uh, 1.4 standard drinks, got a little spiel here, I'll read it out to you. An easy drinking ale made with light malts and European hops for a refreshing, bit of finish, handmade beer. Okay, nice. sounds good. I like it, and where are they? they sounds so crafty. Margaret River, so it's a WA beer. Okay, yeah. That's cool. But, um, In the wine region. Yeah. It's also mentioning Port Melbourne as well, maybe that's where they disputed or something like that. Yeah. yeah let's crack around. Let's do that. Friday. Yes. Something about it, isn't it? Yeah, cheers. Mm. I try. think it's your deck. Yeah. yeah. It's decking good. Yeah. Decking good it's tonight. a great deck. Let's try it out. Mm. Show you what it looks like. Also, it's very light in colour. It's not too bad, it's actually. Cool. Look how clear that is. It's almost a tinge of yellow. Effervescent. Yeah, yeah. always <laughs> You want it to be. You yeah, do. So, you can see that. It's um, surprised me. It's um, not too bad. Oh well, we'll get the taste as we get down the can and we'll see you guys on the other side. On the other side. Cheers. Cheers. And welcome back to the other side. Cyber Slickers, hey, good to I, see you again. Can I just say, that is the most flamboyant shirt I've ever seen. Do you know what? That is I just I feel flamboyant in it. It is. Woo! <laughs> comfy shirt. That's nice, I like it. Actually, every one of those little squares is a picture. Oh, it's, it's lovely. Yeah, yeah. I well, thank you. <laughs> I, d I detect a slight hint of sarcasm no, in I your love voice, it. but I like it. thank you anyway. No, that's good. It's terrific. Mm, back to the beer. Yeah, so yeah. I like this beer. Yes, um, I do too. It's, it's definitely, it's easy to drink, definitely. Mm. It's, um, it's a light beer, as in not alcohol content, but um, drinking... Yeah. Um, it's it's e yeah, as you said easy to drink, but it's um yeah, it's not strong. No, yeah, no. Light as in not strong. No, you can just have a couple of these definitely. Um, yeah, so it's a colchy ale. Kolsch, Kolsch, Kolsch. I think it's pronounced yeah, Kolsch. Yeah. Germany sort of thing. Yeah. Anyway, I think that brings us to interesting fact. Interesting fact indeed. Now, folks, um, a Kolsch is a beer of a unique style. It's not a Pilsner, it's not a Lager, um, it's not an IPA. It is, in fact, a style of beer that originated in Cologne, in Germany. Yeah, right. Yep. Yeah. It has an original gravity, and I'll encourage you to look up what all of this means as I speak. Uh, a, a, a gravity between 11 and 14 degrees. Okay. Okay. So what that means is uh, for you to work out, cyber slingers. <laughs> uh, in appearance, it is bright and clear with a straw yellow hue, and I think that's a pretty good description. That's what exactly what we're getting here. here. Yeah. Yep. So there you go. That's a that's a uh, a Kolsch beer. Now look, it's um, it's uh, it goes down well. It's it's got a it's got a um, pleasant. Um, aftertaste to it, it's not bitter, um, it's not particularly sour, it has a hint, I think a hint of sort of fruitiness to it. Yeah. Um, but it surprised me, I, I thought being in a plain can it would probably be a plain beer, but 
Not yeah. always the case, folks. Right. And we also right. welcome you to, in the comments, just uh, if you know anything more about it than what we've just discussed, chuck them in there, let everyone learn. That's yeah, tell point. us what all that gravity stuff means. Yeah, yeah. it's an adventure. So, uh, what do you rate it, Pompous Man? I'm going to rate it a seven. Seven? Hmm. Yep, I'm, yep, I'm right there too. You're right seven. there too? Yeah, I think it's about a seven, yeah. definitely. Uh, if I was rating the can, I'd probably give it a three and a half, but you still picked it at best. It's um, just white and red, two yeah, colours. Well, hang on, you're right. I, I picked it probably because it was so plain, so yeah. sometimes it may be easier. It looks like to attract people with a plain a, can. There's a picture of, looks like two lions fighting over a star or something. <laughs> Okay. I don't know if you can see that. If yeah. anyone out there knows the significance of that, once again, let yeah, us know. Yeah. Anyway, so that's our Colonial Draft Brewing Co. Colch Ale. Uh, Colch? Colch Ale. Colchy? Colchy. Colch. Yeah, oh, yeah, no. yeah. What? what? I'm just what? a health folk, who knows? Yeah. <laughs> uh, good to have you with us again, Cyber Slickers. It's, um, it's been another awesome evening on the deck. Okay. Um, and uh, who knows where we'll go from here. Yeah, buddy. Probably to episode 20, I'd imagine. Whoa, getting there. Yeah. I'm gonna drink a whole slab soon. Oh yeah. Yeah. See you later. See you guys. Cheers. And always remember to drink responsibly. Thank you.